peace love and light pisces i hope the sun is shining wherever you are and you're living in your greatest purpose let's get into your messages okay pisces checking to see what's in your energy things coming together is what I'm hearing for you messages for Pisces things coming together what's coming together okay so we got this tower card and this king of wands mm. yeah the the tower card is um I'm getting this is a you're getting some revelations at this time and this may be this energy of things coming together that's showing up for you this may be why it's showing up that things are coming together for you mm. okay king of wands Let's fix this. King of Wands is an energy, it's fire energy, creative energy. Um, hmm. Well, if there's anyone that seems to have it together, it's this King of Wands, an energy of power, strength. And specifically, this King of Wands has this, like, Leo kind of, like, energy showing up, supporting it, backing it up. So you may feel like you have the support of your spirit guides at this time. Um... Perhaps this is why you have this energy of revelations. Ten of Cups. Things are coming together. Hmm. You may also feel that things are coming together in matters of the heart, your relationships. You feel like things are looking up or they're on the up and up. This may actually be the revelation that you're having at this time. It's like... Hmm. I'm seeing the words courage. Mm -hmm. Some of you may feel that you've got more courage. You've developed more courage. I see the death card showing in In the back, which may be an indication of like transitioning, removing the old, so that way you can see clearly. Mm. I'm seeing that many of you are, are realizing and you're recognizing your strength. Like you're really seeing yourself as someone who is persistent, persevering. Like this is, this may be the revelation that's showing up for you. Like this King of Wands is not just like anyone. This is fire energy, creative energy. You're also connected to um, your creative power. So you're seeing who you are. You're seeing that courageous side of you that that side that makes you as bold as a lion mm -hmm. and this may be the revelation that you're getting or at least one of them and i'm also seeing that like this there's like a lot of positive energy showing up for you it's almost like you're recognizing how strong you are. You, you're you recognizing, you know, you're recognizing your power and you're recognizing the very energy that may have been 
gotten you through something, perhaps something you've been battling, something that you may have had to endure for quite some time. And it, it required a great amount of strength and courage. So you're really seeing yourself. You're seeing your strength. You're seeing... You're seeing all the positive attributes of you. And I'm also gathering that this energy of revelation is going to allow you to remove what is not serving your highest good. It's like with this kind of energy that you have, anyone that comes or steps at you the wrong way or you know, doing things that they shouldn't be doing. I'm, I'm really seeing that you're, you're not going to be, um, mm, it's like you're, you're not accepting anything low vibrational in your energy. And then this energy of being very selective, that's the word, like you're being very selective. And this is coming as a result of these revelations that you're having about you. And being selective shows the, it really shows how much you uphold yourself in high regard and this is all part of like this revelation that you're having about yourself it's almost like it's almost like an aha moment you know like oh aha like i've always been this like king of wands a strong leader i've always been this person that has spiritual backing um you know, I am this empress who is extremely abundant. I am no longer refusing, you know, these. <laughs> and I'm hearing dirty, nasty cups. I'm not taking any of those dirty, nasty cups. You know, it's a ten of cups for me. If it doesn't come in this shape, size, and, you know, and it, and it fills me up. Um, you know, if it's, if it's not... Uh, fulfilling and filling something fulfilling your desires it's like you're not having it because you're ready for something this energy of abundance and manifestation I'm seeing that you're ready for the next thing you're ready for new ideas new opportunities to come like you you're really ready to elevate okay you're ready to achieve more and these revelations are going to bring even more revelations they're going to bring a lot more beginnings your way a lot of growth a lot of physical um physical growth physical growth in the sense that you'll you'll be able to um see this growth uh materialize i'm seeing that you're really doing away with this energy of self-doubt that has gotten you in positions you know um may have even been self-sabotaging positions so it's like you're removing these energies out of your way because you see yourself differently now Okay, four of cups, you're removing that. And I'm also seeing that this new perspective that you have, it's changing a lot about how you do things, how you see people, where you, whereas before you may have been more apt to see, mm, it's kind of like you, you may have been more willing to give people the benefit of the doubt uh perhaps to even too quickly i'm seeing that's not the case at this time you're more protective of your energy 
you're more protective of your energy because of um because of one the revelations that you're having about you your strength and just also just revelations about who people are like really like people you know um seeing the true color you may be seeing someone's true colors at this time as well so tell me about this king of wands hmm <clears throat> I'm really seeing that this King of Wands energy is like an energy of you just not having it. You know, this kind of energy, this Five of Swords, this King of Wands is like ready for to defend their honor, to defend um, their rightful place in the world. And you're not having anything to do with these folks. Five and Seven of Swords. Hmm. There may have been very, someone very specific. Um, this King of Wands can also be someone. Uh, possibly a fire sign. Leo Sag Aries that's showing up in your energy. Mm, that's like, eh. Perhaps that's that person that's like, it's like, I'm not having it. Like, that cup that you're refusing, it may be that person. Or it may actually be um, another water sign that it's like, you know, that's not your cup of tea kind of thing. And you're just like, what? I ain't drinking out of that dirty cup. Nope. They may be offering and you're like, nope, I'm going to wait for the, I'm going to wait for the right one. I'm going to wait for the right cup. Okay. And that's exactly what's going to happen is that your waiting is actually going to bring all of these possibilities into, you know, they're going to be manifested. Okay. And you're going to see this. All of this energy of positivity is actually going to come towards you as long as you keep this energy of like really showing, showing up for yourself and having this positive energy regarding you know who you are and where you're going okay let's see tell us more about this reading okay so i'm getting that you're getting blessings from your spirit guides and the divine is saying that no good thing shall be withheld from you this is number nine uh blessings of kumu you're receiving the blessings of your spiritual team at this time and this is what they are saying to you okay um Okay. So resources are coming to you now. If you have been in lack, limitation, or anxiety about such things happening, relax and substitute your stress for the absolute trust that the universe will provide all good things with generosity and grace. If you find this challenging, take it one step at a time, reprogramming your heart and mind into new habits, peaceful trusts. It will feel much better to live like this. It's not foolishness, but wisdom that embraces such unconditional faith. Know that the provision of all resources are required. Oh, all the resources, the provision of all the resources required is certainty. The only variables are the details of how the journey unfolds. When you tune into your heart, you remember that you are loved, protected, guided in every moment. Trust the universe. So that that energy of revelation, it's almost like you're remembering. Like that 
exactly what was just said you're remembering that you're love you're protected it's like it's like this energy of like this energy of revelation showing up it's like you're remembering all of these positive attributes about yourself and it's putting you in a place where like you're literally not to be messed with okay you're not to be messed with and it's like anyone that comes in an energy that is like vibrating at a frequency that's lower than that and you know it's really showing up here with the four of this four of cups showing up it's like mm, no thank you i'm not having it you know i know i deserve better i know i can do better for myself um i know that more is coming to me okay and that is the message because the divine is saying no good thing shall be withheld from you all right and so you're living in this truth and living in this truth means you are refusing and repelling all negative energy that's not serving your highest good that's not here to see you manifest your highest your highest self all right that is the message if this message resonates please like comment share and subscribe until next time love peace divine light